So here we are approaching the runway of 1-3 left at John F. Kennedy International. Our first step is to put our flaps to 15 for taxi and for takeoff. Once you get a little closer to the holding short area, you want to start braking with your rudder to get perfectly aligned and stop at the hold short area. The next step is going to be trim. As the title says, I will be showing you how to take off on the 777. And for the 777, I would highly recommend 10% of trim. As you can see, I just set the trim to 10 After you have checked everything and made sure that everything is perfect, like your flaps and trim, you can go ahead and start lining up onto the runway, as I'm doing right now. And once you're lined up, you want to double check everything and make sure everything has been done. After this, you can go ahead and release your parking brake and start turning up the throttle. You slowly want to put it up to 50% and wait a few seconds. After you do that, you want to go ahead and turn it up to 90% a little bit faster than before. You want to slowly start tilting your device up or rotating once you get to 150 to 160 knots. You know you have fully gone in the air and are airborne when you see this little circle pop up right here. You want to keep going and a few seconds after takeoff, put your gear up. After that, a few seconds later, you want to put your trim up like I do in the video a few seconds after this. You want to keep a stable climb rate after takeoff so that your plane is stable and doesn't stall out. Once you get to 2,100 feet, you want to put your flaps up like I am doing in the clip right here. Now that you finish watching this video, go to Infinite Flight and try it yourself by combining all of these steps and try to make it look like this.